This is Derek Ray, and I'm joined for commentary by the former Arsenal and West Ham player Stuart Robson. And it is a first test for these two countries here at the 2022 FIFA World Cup. It's Spain versus Germany. Well, thanks, Derek. This is such an important game. Both sides will be desperate to start this group well. Let's hope we see some great football today. And here is Thomas Müller. And a goal! Not wasting much time today. They strike first. Well, as you can see, his movement is really good, which then makes the finish look easy. That's a decent goal, that's for sure. Back underway, 1-0 it is. Pablo Sarabia. Koke now gets involved on the attacking side of things. Sarabia. Well, they keep the ball moving. Morata. Surely the equaliser. And effectively parried away by the keeper. Serge Gnabry. Kimmich. Well, spot on with that challenge. Pablo Sarabia. Morata. On to Carvajal. Sarabia. Carvajal, a very effective clearance. Goretzka. And Havertz. Germany pushing forward with options available. And here is Thomas Müller. And a really good diving stop. How about the short corner? And good use of advantage. The referee allowing play to continue. Müller. Now with Goretzka. And a goal to really bolster things for them. Two in front. Well, we won't get tired of watching this because the interplay around the box is wonderful and he makes the finish look so easy. What a good goal that is. So underway once more, 2-0 the lead here. Number seven. Pablo Sarabia just looking for the right moment for that final pass now they stop them in their tracks Müller now with Kimi Serge Gnabry good move in the making from Germany Great chance to make it a brace, but the keeper had his say. Well, he has to get a second goal soon. He's been brilliant today. He's driven in the corner. It might still be problematic. Well, they can bring it out now.
Sergio Busquets. And scope for them to produce something exciting. But nothing comes of it. Good defending it was. Serge Gnabry. Müller. Sané. Could be. And it goes. A three-goal cushion. And you truly sense it's a matter of how many. Well, here's the replay, and just look at that power. That's almost unstoppable. That's a great strike. And the action underway once more, with Germany very much on top. Koke. And on the ball, Sarabia. Just the challenge that was required. Opportunity in the wide area. Kai Havertz. A goal! And I'll tell you what, on this sort of form, very few would lay a glove on them. Let's look at this again. The one and two touch passing is absolutely outstanding to play around the pressure. And then what a strike. That's hit with such ferocity. Certainly no stopping that. That's a great goal. Blistering first half display. And just look at that score. Sergio Busquets. Well, that's how to put in a clean tackle. Kai Havertz. Return to Zane. And Havertz. Havertz. Now Muda. Zane. Can he take advantage? He had to react and did. And the counter attack is on. Options available. Laporte well adding up all the stoppages we will have two extra minutes is this the moment and there is the goal he's found the net joy unconfined Well, as you can see, his movement is really good, which then makes the finish look easy. That's a decent goal, that's for sure. Well, not too much defending going on in the grand scheme of things. 4-1. And so it is, the first half story has been written. Well, you might say he's a bit unorthodox, Thomas Muller, but my goodness, he's so very effective, Stuart. Well, he's run the game, hasn't he? Everything's gone through him. His passing has been excellent, and he's provided a goal-scoring pass as well. So the two teams have switched around, and the second half is underway. Morata. Marvellous anticipation. Sané. Breaking at pace. And both hands on it. Good goalkeeping. Ferran Torres. Now Jordi Alba. Jordi Alba Pedri 
Well, he went strongly into the challenge, and the result is a throw-in. Oh, it comes to nothing in the end. Really should have made more of that. This looks threatening. And a goal to delight the fans! Just what they were hoping for! Well, here it is again. The through ball is absolutely inch perfect. And once he gets onto it, he just smashes it past the keeper with great technique. What an emphatic finish that is. So the current scoreline, 4-2. Kai Havertz. And with that, the attack fizzles out. And so 30 minutes left for play in this one. Pedri. And with that, the attack fizzles out. Well, as those stats tell us, Germany have been second best in terms of possession. But when they have won it back in midfield areas, their counter-attacking has been excellent. They'll be happy with the way the game's going at the moment. Easy meet for the goalkeeper. Pau Torres. Morasa. Morasa! Well, it's great awareness of space in the box, and then he shows a lot of composure with the finish. That's a clever goal. Goal. Well, how about this? 4-3. Sané. This is Müller. Sané. Fine tackle there to prevent the chance. Koke. Now with Morata. Now with Havertz. He's in here. Well, if only he had timed his run slightly better. Offside. And they're making a change. Fifteen minutes left for play. Still behind, but the pressure mounting. Morata onto Koke. Jordi Alba, superb block. Surely the equaliser can't get the shot through. Well, that's how to keep the opposition at bay. And the counter attack is on, options available. Thomas Müller. Havertz. And an astute piece of defending. 
Pedri. Into an attacking position. It's not too late for them. Busquets. The defender doing his job. Sané. Oh, lovely ball. Oh, big chance. Really important tackle. Torres. Koke with it. Racing forward, trying to catch them out. Can they take advantage of the situation? Well, that break looked so uh, promising, but nothing coming from it. Well, adding up all the stoppages, we will have two extra minutes. Serge Gnabry. This is Müller. And it's Müller finding forward gears. And players waiting in the centre. It's all over. And a Spanish defeat. Well, they were hoping that wouldn't be the big story at the end of the game. But they haven't got their wish. Stuart, your analysis. Well, Derek, it was a poor result, but it was a really tight contest. Both sides had their chances. Could have gone either way. But in the end, they will be disappointed. Well, a standout performance from Kai Havertz. Not for the first time, you've got to say. Stuart, he really turned on the style. Well, he did everything today. His energy, skill and movement was just too good for those defenders. It was a really good display.